morning everybody uh, we're on our way to Lincolnshire uh, we pulled over really late last night um, on our way because it's getting too dark to drive uh, we didn't know where we were properly so uh, I'll take you for a look around and uh, show you what it's like there's the main road there we pulled in we're coming this way just over here it's not bad it's right off the road and it looks like we're next to a big field we had a peaceful night, we couldn't hear the traffic last night, obviously it's 10 o'clock now so it's getting really really busy on a weekday, but not bad at all. That looks nice doesn't it? Even got dog treats for Lily. Ooh, Lily! Nom, 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 nom. Nom. Nice? <laughs> yes. Yes, mummy. Nice. That looks good, doesn't it? I can't see this one. Are you trying to eat? Oh, that's nice. Oh, my God, it's like some sort of cat and birds, isn't it? Oh, my Lord. Wow. I've never seen so many in one place. Oh, look. Oh, look. oh my god, how many is there? Yeah, there's loads. Oh, we don't know. Nice. Look, some Canadian cats. For a chat about our new upcoming plans uh, for our new camper and I'll hand you over to Paul because he's the man so <laughs> yeah. uh, last time I looked yeah right um yeah we've bought a Renault Master medium wheelbase uh high top so we're going to convert it um be, be our first conversion from scratch if you know what I mean so um so that's it we're going to be well, sort of keeping you updated with it all, all the way through um, and showing you how with the procedures we do things and whatever um, the main thing is is that the the main, yeah the main thing of it is is a solid fixed bed um, that was one of the things that we love our bongo van um, absolutely love it you know I'll be sad to get rid of it um, but obviously having a fixed bed will be a bonus won't it yeah we have to pull out this one every night and one of us get out the van one of us get in um and in the morning as well when it's you know especially now the weather's getting colder as well jumping in that van to put the pool bed out um these vans are brilliant for you know maybe well i'm tall for one so but you know they're, they're lovely vans don't get me wrong we've got a large dog and you know it's not easy um although we love it but i think it'd be an extra bonus to get a uh you know slightly bigger van and yeah i think the and thing also the excitement of doing the conversion isn't it yeah yeah i think the thing is with the bongos that you can take them literally anywhere um we've just gone through like a uh, a two meter restrict height restriction <coughs> and it goes straight through uh so you haven't got to worry uh but the only that's the only thing now is like with the larger van is is planning our route a bit more uh so if we want to look at places and where we want to go then we have got to start thinking right if there is a two meter restriction or whatever um or if they're going to close a two meter gate down while you're parked up overnight then you've got to take that into consideration um but yeah it's uh and if you guys got any questions isn't it as well yeah, yeah. um regarding the conversion um it'll be starting soon and we'll yeah. get some footage up and get some videos running uh, questions, questions help, yeah even anything. if you want to offer any advice you know if you see yeah. we're doing something wrong we're up for any we're not going to take any criticism bad you I, know or as i say um, i think it's all I, constructive isn't it <laughs> yeah i think with anything it's 
everything is a learning curve um yeah. you know because if there'd be there'd be one of you guys out there that go do you know what i've done this and this i found this works better brilliant because then it saves us doing it and going do you know what it just don't work um and, and i think again it's not it's like more on like on the experience side of things where you have people that have done certain things you know we, we've watched like youtube um videos and, and the guy said right this is mark one mark two mark three mark four and he's improved it because he said right i didn't like, like the way this worked didn't like the way that worked so he improved it so you know and you're always learning um when you're away of how you, things work for you which you know which is great you know yeah so. yeah i mean we're new to this uh youtube van life thing um we're loving it and we know that some of our um you know few subscribers you know man uh, uh, uh can't see that a uh, bongo enthusiasts you know and we're gonna be you know traveling in this and while the conversion's running so you know and you know as you can see it's a lovely little van it's cozy we love it so you know hopefully you'll stay on board with us <laughs> because i know there's a few of you out there we've had a couple of comments yeah and you know later on down the line we might do a questions and answers and you know the, yeah. tip, the typical yeah. q and a <laughs> so if any of you got any questions just put it in the link <coughs> below um i think that's what they do don't they <laughs> yeah yeah oh yeah Thank, thanks george for the comment um yeah. and i hope you you know find a rack on the back for your bungo um as i say that it, it, it is it is a pain trying to find the right ones for what you want to use um you know because like the one we had like i said to george you know the thing is at the end of the day we had to get a just a normal bike rack and then we had to extend it mm. width, width wise and height wise so that i could actually put a fold down uh rack so that we could put a box on there so if we want to put the awning in there or well, even if you wanted to blow up a kayak anything like that yeah. it just gives you then that uh it just takes it out of here you know so it's all right if you've if you've pulled up you can pop the roof up and chuck it up the top you know and this out of your way but while you're driving you don't want it in the like the, the rear area here because it's just going to take up every every bit of room you got so <laughs> sorry yeah <laughs> yeah because we, we've got a kayak haven't we yeah well and, uh, we <laughs> Well, we got the plas plastic molded one because I didn't want to keep on pumping it up and letting it back down. A so, a pair of fifty somethings in a kayak. That's going to be yeah. a new one. That'd be fun. No, I like trying new things. This, this is good. I'm really enjoying myself with all this. Yeah, she um, says that. What's it? Until <laughs> until we try to get a two point seven meter kayak on top of a camper van roof. Oh, no, me trying to get in so, and out of it. But I, never mind. We can, I wouldn't, good yeah. thing is we can edit this. We can cut bits out. It is fine. Yeah, we don't have to upload it. And, you know, well, it's I'm all just right. wondering okay, who's going to be on the roof pulling it up. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. I'll, yeah. Let him, I'll let him be the man. Yeah, that's it. We're saying. I know I talk a lot. <coughs> but, you know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right. um, oh, no, never, never. God forbid, dear. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Anyway, but, it's really nice because we know there's a few of you out there. Um, it's just nice people we haven't even met you know and um we have had a couple of comments and you know it's appreciated because we are new we're a new channel um and we know it takes some time but yeah hopefully you'll stay on board and um we'll see you guys soon anyway yeah right. oh, oh, oh hold, 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 on, on, hold on. on we did say about staying at where was it where did we say we was going to stay oh it, oh we was going to stay at the nature reserve yeah we was going to stay at the we nature changed reserve that because there was uh dog people of a different kind yeah yeah okay yeah. but we won't go into that so no. anyway we've moved we've moved somewhere so, um, yeah so we've moved to princess parade car park in skegness Skeg skegness yeah. Uh, yeah 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 so it's all right What's oh, the practice run. i called it clapton on sea but i don't think there's a lot of difference in it to be fair <laughs> but anyway we won't go into why but viewers yeah. know what we mean there okay um, <laughs> yeah but by all accounts there's meant to be fossils on the beach here uh, yeah. which is going to be interesting to find now um yeah. and take lily out for a walk tomorrow morning yeah see what's out there <coughs> we've um already tried the local fish and chips you know that healthy option 
Um, <laughs> I know people get comments about <laughs> unhealthy options, don't uh, they? But... I'm, I'm sure there's more unhealthy things out there than no, fish and earlier, chips. No, earlier on, um, earlier on today, as you, you would see, so that you have seen, uh, you know, we had dressed crab and salad. I mean, that's mm. healthy, isn't it? Is yeah, it? Yeah. yeah, it that's is. It. Yeah. 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 Uh... As long as Paul don't get fish poisoning later on. <laughs> no, no, no. They get all crabby. Anyway, we're rattling on now. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so you take care. See you guys yeah, later. Yeah, and uh, we'll catch you up with you when we're no, when we're doing the camper van. All right, take care. All bye. Right, bye.